thought I'd do a quick video on the Flexo Power Nano 240 watt. It's a solar panel, a mobile one uh, that you can take with you. It's designed probably more for camping than what I'm using it for, but I decided to get this as a backup um, for when there's load shedding, especially to keep my fridge going and um, just to get connected to my backup system, which I also run my computer and home office off. So it has four panels I'm going to show you. So this is the front side. You might be wondering what this is. This is a little leg that flips out. So if you wanted to um, lie the panel on the floor when you're out camping, um, you can take these out. There are a few. And if I open this up now, you'll see there are four panels. Each of them would be 60 watts. Four times 60 will give you your 240. And what I found is if I, for instance, take away one panel and I leave it in the sun like this, then I would get the performance of three instead of four. So they must have wired these so that if let's say there's shade on one of them, it doesn't cut the performance of the whole um, panel or collection of panels. So that's quite cool. And then on this side, there's a pouch and another leg. And in here, you've got your connector. Yeah, so see the plus and the minus there. And it actually, <clears throat> the one that I bought came with a 10 meter extension, which is over there. And I'll show you later how I connect it to my little backup system. So because I don't have a lot of sunshine here on the grass, what I'm going to do is put it on my roof and it's quite simple. I just take a, a ladder, see the ladder there, and I put it on top of my roof when I need it. So you can see all I've done is put it on the roof, very simple because I don't intend it to be permanent. It's just when I really need it during a long set of load shedding. And then I've got the cable here, which I'm going to connect to my little backup system. So you see the cable now coming from the roof. Very simple. Just pull it here to my backup system, which is over here. You can see this is my charger inverter. It's a Victron Multi Plus 12 volt. Um, I think it's rated for 600 watts and here's a smart solar charger um, it's a 7015 and that's where my panel is going to plug in so quite simple just like that now what I'm going to do is I've got a Victron <coughs> And here I can see my panel, well actually the smart solar and how much power is coming from the panel. Obviously if the battery was full it wouldn't be pulling any power, um, so at the moment you can see it's going up and down, various wattages, and like I say it's, well you can see there 11.39 on a July clear sunny day. And the highest I've had for this panel um, at different times in the day was 147 watts, which is 100 watts less than what it's rated for. So there you go, there's my brief summary of the panel. Um, I would have expected some higher wattages, a bit of performance, but I think for my purposes it's okay. I'm in my fridge when it's pulling power is about 80 watts so if I get 147 that's okay I can still charge some of my battery uh, my home office setup maybe takes about maximum 60 watts um, if I'm just doing office work so that's fine just to show you this if you're interested the specs of the panel I bought this one as a demo model and 
cost me 7,000 Rand. Now, I could have put a panel on my roof, a permanent one, which costs maybe 3,000, but you'd have to get the roof mounting structure. You need to get it fixed to the roof, run some wires, do all sorts of things. Um, in my complex, I'd have to pay insurance for the building because it's now part of the building and um, that would cost me extra. Not to mention if I were to sell my place, then um, the panel would probably have to stay. So this is my portable solution. I can take it with me if I do decide to go camping or go somewhere where there's no power. It'll be more than enough to power a laptop, a phone, a fridge, whatever I need when I'm out and about. So I hope that video was, I hope this video was useful. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thanks.